so since I have a bit of time on my hands now with this coronavirus pandemic and there's no work I get to ride around a bit more and see a few more places So we are going to be going down there Brennan Castle is just beside Thomastown GAA pitch. So we're just gonna walk in and have a look. Brennan Castle was built in the 13th century. It's a 20 meter long castle. Brennan Castle is just 15 minutes outside Kenny City. River Nor just flows along the bank over there. That's Grenon Castle. So that's the first stop of maybe two or three. We'll have to see. It's starting to get warm again now, it's about 20 degrees again today so now we're gonna pull in down here so this was Sweetman's Castle it's now known as Mullins Castle you have the river just beside it here Established in 1350, and this is the same River Noor that was down by Grenon Castle. Another close up. So that was Sweetman's Castle or Mullins Castle as it's known now. Church is 
just up here on the left. Oh, here we go. Okay, so there is our church. But then that says Gilfane Church that way. I'll go have a look. So when you walk in that little gate, there's a little drive. And this is actually Kilfane Church. Kilfane Church was built in the 13th century. That's cool. Now can you in here? founders of this place were the Cantwell family and the name Kilfane came from this saint, Saint Fian. That's a big grave. Rothwell. 2011, someone was last buried here. And that's Kilfane Church. Just on the outskirts of Thomastown. That's the last place I'm going to go for a look for today. I'm going to head back home now. So that was Brennan Castle, Sweetman's Castle, and Kilfane Church. Now oh, I forgot to tie my jacket off. <laughs> 